have the last of the most famous ship in history, the RMS Titanic. The Titanic was completed March 31st, 1911 in the Hauling and Roof Shipyard in Belfast. This is an Amazon directly taken from Google Earth. As you can see, this right here, as you can see, this right here, as you can see, this right here is the North Atlantic Ocean. And right, and that red arrow is where the Titanic rests today on the seafloor. The morning, on the morning of 15 April 1912, the Titanic set off for its first and last voyage across the Atlantic. But just after midnight, the Titanic hit an iceberg in the bow began to dip, rising the propellers out of the water. This is a layout of the Titan. This is a layout of the Titanic. Anyways, back to the sinking part. Remember I said at 2.20 a.m. Remember how I said, remember how I, remember, I mean, remember how I said that the Titanic hit the iceberg and the earlier I said the Titanic hit the iceberg and the propellers rose out of the air? Well, at 2.20 a.m., the Titanic rose out of the air just like I showed you in that last in that last picture, propellers up in the air just like the last one. But at 2:20 a.m., the ship. But at 2:20, but at 2:20 a.m., the ship split in half, sinking to the bottom. This is the wreck of the Titanic. It is a tango wreck on the ocean. It is a tango wreck on the bottom of the ocean with hundreds of broken up pieces because of the breakup. Dr. Robert Bauer was the one who found it. What the ship used to look out like compared to now, this was, I believe, a cabin or the furnace room or the, or what held the furnace. This is what it used to look like compared to this. The Titanic feature the best comfort for buying a low safety precaution of safety. Titanic was the put Titanic was the prettiest ship ever. The end.